Hi everyone, I am Carl Mander and you are in my channel. So ang gagawin natin ngayon is magre-report ng mga pinamili kong halaman sa Baguio. Most of them are echeverias. A little backstory, uh, back then I have 5 leafy succulents. Three of them are Kalankowis, which are easy to care, and yung isa is a Moonstone and an Echeveria Black Prince. So, konti lang succulents ko dati kasi I had hard time um, caring for them. Lagi akong nalulusawan, namamatayan, kaya halos sa cactus lang ako. Pero ngayon, um, dinadagdagan ko na sila. So far, wala naman ako napapatay. At yun, ire-repat natin sila ngayon. Let's go! Our trip to Baguio was fun. But what made it even more fun? Yes, you got it right. Plants. Tama na to. Let's get repotting! So ito yung mga kailangan pag nagre-repot. First, the medium. You want your soil to be fast draining. Succulents are very prone to root rot, kaya you want a medium that doesn't retain water too long. Yung mix ko is half soil, half sand. Then, pumice or pumice, whatever you call it, basta ito yun. This allows air to flow in your mix and allow roots to breathe. Pumice is somehow optional kasi yung ibang succulents nagsasurvive naman without this. Pero, you have to lessen your watering. However, kung gusto mong tumaas yung survival rate ng plants mo, kailangan mong i-include yung pumice sa mix mo. Susunod, syempre, pot or paso. In terms of pots, dapat i-consider mo yung size ng plant at yung root system nito. And last but not the least, syempre yung itatanim mo, the plants. Specifically, Echeverias, a genus of succulent that has a shallow root system. So tama lang yung mga pots na gagamitin ko. Let's start. First, remove the plants from the bag and completely remove the soil. Take note, kapag bumili ka ng halaman, lalo na from Baguio, it is necessary na i-replace mo yung soil with your own mix. Different soil mix prefer different climates. Maaaring sa bagyo nagwo-work yung gantong mix pero sa lowland hindi. Ito yung madalas na nakakaligtaan ng mga naghahalaman lalo na yung mga bago pa lang na nagko-cause ng death ng halaman. Maglagay ng first layer of soil. Then, ipwesto na yung plant. Tapos, lagay ulit ng soil. Kailangan din ay tap yung pots para mafill yung voids inside. Yung paglagay ko ng pumice as toppings ay para maging stable yung plant at di magalaw. <laughs> Pagpasensya nyo na ako ha, I prefer gardening this way. <laughs> Ganun lang kadali magripat ng halaman. Important notes lang, be gentle kapag nire-remove yung soil para less stress sa halaman. Then, your medium must be fast draining. Then, after repotting, let your plants adjust. Huwag muna ipwesto sa direct sun and huwag muna diligan for at least one week. You don't have to worry kasi di naman sila mamamatay. Remember, they are succulents so meron silang nakaimbak na tubig inside their bodies. After noon, slowly introduce them to sunlight till they regain their original form. Yun lang naman for this video. Hoping na nakapulot kayo ng mga tips. <laughs> Kung nagustuhan nyo yung video na to, give it a like and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you! See you again soon!